Okay, so I know the glare is terrible, but I just want to make this really quick video because this is the coolest thing. Okay, so, so I know y'all have all heard about side sink, but it works really cool. So let me show you. Okay, so say you have your phone. It has to be a Galaxy S phone, and it has to be running KitKat. <clears throat> but once you have it running that, you just install... You install SideSync, and you open it, okay? And then, oh, here it is, it's already running. Switch to tablet, see? But let's start over, because, yeah, okay. You gotta start over. Okay, so you just would hit this, and then that, okay? And then it's gonna scan, it's gonna find this. Once it finds that, you select it. Then this is gonna shut off the screen to save battery, I guess. And then you can put that out of the way. Then here's your phone. Now you can resize this too. I haven't really figured out how. But I know there's a way. I think you hold it. Well, you can resize it. Trust me. So everything you can do on your phone, you can do here. You can make phone calls. Well, not from there. <laughs> you can make phone calls. Okay. If you're going to call somebody, you just start dialing. And the really nice thing is that anything that's on here, any of the content or anything that you need, you don't have to, you know, wires or anything. You just open up the gallery, you find the pictures that you would want, and then you drag them. Let's see. Well, then you drag them into the gallery on this phone. It's pretty damn cool, I must say. Now for me, it doesn't, I mean, I just had to have this just because it was so cute and I just loved the way it worked. Cause I had a Samsung computer that did this, but it did really slow cause it didn't have the processing power and this definitely does. But I will say this, I do not need to have my phone on my tablet because if you can believe it, let's get out of it. Oh, and then you can like reduce it down and you can just keep it right here floating anywhere that you want. And then if you want to get it back, you just reopen it, reopen it. Okay, so how cool is that? That is too cool. But anyway, you can take a screenshot. Like if you're, you know, here and you want a screenshot, you just hit that and that takes a screenshot. Now I haven't figured out how to get out of a screenshot. Let's hit save and see if we can get out of it. Okay. Save. I think that's for printing. I don't know. I haven't got all the kinks worked out. Okay, close it. So that's so cool. See, and then once you close it, then your phone comes back to life. Is that too neat? But I do want to show y'all that this is the Galaxy Tab S, which is so, so paper thin. It's like unbelievable. The only thing I don't like about it, and I love everything about it, is the gold trim because it, you know, what's with that? I mean, everything I have has got a silver trim. But I can live with it. But this is the Galaxy Tab S LTE with a phone version. So I have my own phone right here. So I don't ever need to put my tablet here. But if I wanted stuff that was on that phone, I could just sync them that way. So that's pretty much it. Just wanted to share. I get some other things that I've gotten that I'm going to make a video of. But this was just while I was thinking about it. Thanks, y'all. Bye.